Welcome back to our channel. Since last three videos, we had been discussing regarding how to prepare for the examinations, how to improve your skills, how to be dynamic in your thoughts, with your information and everything, with current affairs and everything. Now let us discuss to manage all these things. Lots of NCIT books were discussed. We discussed about different magazines. We discussed about different types of newspapers and all that one. Now, how to plan your time to do all this is the most important aspect which will decide your success. It's not only what you read, it's also how you read is more important. And to how to read, what to read, and how to plan your day, how to plan your the whole preparatory program, what steps you have to take, what you have to keep in your mind. Generally, some people they say that what the recent uh, June 5th, 2022 question paper, some newspapers, the analysis came that one, uh, the question paper is too lengthy. Some people say that what the time is not enough. Some people say that there is more to do, there is less time. But we can say that one, time is for everyone the same. It's 24 hours only a day, whatever may be. The nature has fixed its own alarm clock, saying that one, it is sunrise to sunset, sunset to early morning, morning to evening. So, the time is safe for everyone. The Prime Minister of India or the President of India or the Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh or the Chief Minister of some other state or the President of America, the President of Russia. They don't get any extra time. They too have only 24 hours time. Whether it is a street vendor or a civil servant or a public personality, a great writer, Whatever may be, everyone has managed their time within that 24 hours of three. So, it is pretty clear that the time is fixed. You can't allow the time. You have to manage your time. What we call this one, the time management. The time management is very, very important. We should run with the clock. You run before the clock. You run after the clock, will decide your success. Right time, right place, right work, at the right moment of time will help you for your success. A second a late, you will miss the flight. A second a late, you may miss the train. So everything is time out. So we should plan our whole day as per the time. So 24 hours time we have. Within this 24 hours time, there is a must and should that one. 12 hours time cannot be in our hand because it goes to the uh, our rest time. That is the small things what you do for our daily our preparation everything, our personal hygiene and our food and everything. A maximum 12 hours, minimum 12 hours is left. The remaining 12 hours only you have to plan. And there is one English saying, time and tide waits for none. They don't wait. We should go according to the time. So the remaining 12 hours of time, how you plan? And generally for any preparation for the examination or any preparation for your skill development, the most important aspect required is, the most important required is, this 12 hours of time, what you want to do, you do in a regular basis. One day, one time, another day, another time. One day you spend a sleepless night, the other day you sleep whole day. That will completely disturb your preparatory programs and all that work. And if you want to make it, morning 5 o'clock, you want to be ready. Every day, please, within the 10 minutes, this side, that side, it's okay, no problem. But you keep yourself ready every day at that particular point of time. Because our body clock, we have to set. And body clock, once you set, 
don't disturb your body clock each day what time each day, the other day the other time this is not proper whatever may be before 7 o'clock you complete everything get ready yourself and sit for your studies and all that one first one hour one and a half hours time or two hours time spent only on this papers and magazines and analyzing them go on analyzing the news items with the help of so many other tips and all that one then you go for your general studies paper generally when you are kind of completing your news paper reading as well as your magazines and all that work most of the current topics are getting completed not only that one some of the political events political political sides uh, geographical matters climatic matters environmental matters the sports literature and so many other things are also covered with the current topics so what happens if you add this one you interrelate your current topic with your uh, general studies paper with your optional subject that it will be very useful and that keeps you dynamic in your thought so please see that one the timing should follow properly so 7 o'clock you have set up your time and all that one maximum by 9:30 10 o'clock you complete all this one and if every 2 hours or 2 and a half hours once at least there should be half an hour break break there should be half an hour break because the withstanding capacity of the mind is limited and if you go on doing it even though your mind is refusing your body is refusing it will create fatigue it will create fatigue and that fatigue will not help you to accumulate to understand the matter so max of 2 hours to 8 hours give me a break small break But then again you start regarding your other subjects and all that one then go for lunch 12:30 before 1 o'clock complete your lunch then you offer a break or one hour break then again you resume your studies and for these students who want to go for high competitive examinations and all that part i request them at least one hour to two hours the time is required for your play play must be your everyday activity that keeps you physically fit mentally alert as well as what i can see rejuvenates your energy it rejuvenates your energy so for rejuvenation and also these examinations like ips ias ifs and just whatever customs and all that one they should have the mental stamina physical stamina mental stamina and physical stamina you want means you require regular exercise either you go for regular exercise or else you go for one hour two hours play playing such things that which completely stretches your muscles stretching your muscle will help you to stretch your mind also then take a small break drink something eat something then again resume 8 8:39 retire completely don't think about anything at the maximum at 10 o'clock sleep happily your day's work will keep you completely by evening a happy sleep you will get the people who sleep the night time properly or let us say 10 o'clock to 5 o'clock your sleep is maximum enough and 10 to 5 if you sleep properly again next day you will have the new life new energy so plan your one month properly and every month you go on resuming what you are doing and all that work you review the things what you are doing and next month whatever uh, just uh, drawbacks you have found in your previous month that you can cover it that that will be good for your preparation and what we request you is the time management is very very important and you follow that one and from next our videos onwards we will be going on 
subject wise the topic wise analysis discussing discussing about the concept concept analysis and how the exam preparation are going on and all that one we will be discussing so please stay tuned to our next video so that you will get more information regarding subject wise and also not only for ias ips what we want to do is we will be doing videos for the high school students and also degree students and all that one subject wise so please if you like it like it please subscribe and share it thank you very much